come to my vlog. Today, I will discuss to you what I have learned our subject, the teaching profession, but I will focus only on the code of ethics, on how important the code of ethics is, okay? The code of ethics for teachers is designed to protect the rights of the students. It is important that teachers understand that when they get a teaching position, they are agreeing to follow the code of ethics. Teachers are expected to be fair to all their students and not to take advantage of their position in any way. For example, you can't accept expensive gifts for the students because it might appear to bias you. You can push your personal beliefs and students because they are a captive audience. You need to have a professional relationship with all students and not let it go to casual and familiar. Apparently, there is a quite a bit of abuse that is happening in the school. You need to protect your students safely and not believe that this is someone else's job. The main thing is not to abuse the power that your position. is to provide a quality education to all students. A professional code of ethics must address this fact, stating that teachers must not show favoritism or discriminate against students. Teachers also must interact with students appropriately, not taking advantage of students in any way, bullying students or putting them down. Contact with students outside of the classroom or school building must be kept to a minimum and must focus on school-related activities and events. In addition to a teacher's job to help all students learn, a professional code of ethics also addresses a teacher's responsibility to keep students safe. They Teachers must abide by all school and classroom safety procedures to ensure students' safety. It is also a teacher's responsibility to report instances of bullying and harassment. If a teacher suspects cases of abuses or neglect, or a student confides in a teacher in cases or of cases of abuses or neglect, the teacher is required to report it to the proper authorities even if the students requ request otherwise. Teachers must maintain ethical behavior in professional practice by accurately representing and maintaining certification, licenses, and other qualifications. Applying for teaching certificate with false information or lying about meeting in the requirements to renew the certificate can lead to a loss of teaching privileges. In addition to qualification, teachers must practice ethical behavior when it comes to reporting grades and handling assessments, misrepresenting grades or altering students' responses on assessment can lead to criminal charges and the loss of a job. School teachers must collaborate with administrators, fellow teachers, and other employees in order to provide a safe and positive learning experience for students. A teacher must follow the direction of administrators even if rules or expectations seem unreasonable. In order to avoid undermining an administrator's authority and to set a positive example for students, 
when it comes or when disagreements arise between teachers they must handle the disagreements in private and refrain from talking negatively about colleagues in front of students aside from colleagues teachers have a responsibility to interact positively with parents and other stakeholders in a child's education contact with parents must be kept professional free from arguments and physical contact if a teacher has an issue with a parent another teacher or, or administrator must be present during all meetings teachers also must avoid being unduly influenced by parents and other stakeholders when it comes to students grades or other school related matters that would be all for today thank you for watching please follow and subscribe bye